I feel like it's on its way out. I'm at the back end of it, but um, still lingering. What I'm showing you today, 5,000 calories on my diet. I've changed a couple things from last week. You know, last week um, I was slowly kind of building up to 5,000 and just finally decided, you know, fuck it, let's just do 5,000. But I've changed a few things. Instead of six ounces of meat, um, I do five ounces of meat, and that's either gonna be flank steak or 96 four ground beef. Reducing an ounce from each of those meals has allowed me to add in two whole eggs to each one of those meals. And I took off half of a scoop for my protein shake, that's first thing in the morning. That was enough to balance out um, the protein. So now I'm still getting in 375 grams of protein a day while still keeping my fat at about 120 per day. My carbs are right around 600 because I bumped my rice from doing 90 grams weighed raw to 110 grams weighed raw, which 110 grams raw of rice is actually considered one whole cup of raw rice. So, and that's instant rice, by the way, it's in the microwave. Instant rice, it's super easy, it takes three minutes to cook. Um, that's why I use it. So, those are the only changes to the plan, mostly because I've, I feel like uh, Stan's been pushing whole eggs a lot more on the vertical diet, and I was only getting two whole eggs a day, and now I'm gonna be getting eight whole eggs a day. I decided to completely cut the potato out. I mean, really, the potato is there for potassium. Like, that's the main reason for it. However, I get plenty of potassium through everything else that I eat. I still get 6,234 milligrams of potassium a day. The goal that we're shooting for is 4,700, so I'm blowing that number out of the water. And I'm also getting 41 grams of, of fiber with what I eat. Adding in a potato, like taking away rice and adding in a potato, is just gonna add that much more fiber and make me have to shit a lot more. And that is not something that I'm down with. So um, yeah, so my macros are 375 protein, 600 carbs, and 125 fat. That's what I'm doing today, that's what I'm showing you today. Let's keep it going. All right guys, it's time to get ready to go do shoulders. I'm gonna sip on this for the next 30 minutes. This is one scoop of Total War, one scoop of Big Noise, and some sodium. If you guys want any of these products, click the link down in the description box below to head over to redcon1.com. Use my code D20CHASEI to get yourself 20% off. It helps support the channel, gets you some good products at a better price than what you could without it. So please try it out. It's good shit. All right, so I'm gonna sip on this for the next 30 minutes. And guys, I disagree with the whole like, you know, like scooping and popping it in your mouth sort of thing. Like I used to do that, but the thing is the guys at Redcon One are like manufacturing team. They put out a post because a lot, of, a lot of us were doing that. I mean, I wasn't, but a lot of guys were doing that and they put out a post saying, you, you know what guys, these products aren't made for you to do that with. The thing is, they need lots of water so that they can dissolve and be, you know, absorbed properly. Like, it's not the smartest decision. Like, yeah, it might look cool and, you know, seem to be hardcore or whatever, but it's not smart because it's not going to work the way that they intended it to work. So, I highly recommend taking your time with your pre-workout, sipping on it over the course of 30 minutes or so, and uh, just giving it time to do its thing. 
you know, instead of just popping the whole scoop, chugging a bunch of water, you know, when you're in the parking lot and then going to go lift. So that's my tip of the day for you guys. All right, so I'm gonna drink on this and I will see you guys when I put my intro workout shake together. All right, guys, that's it. That's everything for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something today. Thank you so much for stopping by. Remember, nobody cares. Train harder, and I will see you all tomorrow.